Hi guys, it's Ruthie and welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to do something I haven't really done in a long time. Painting in Photoshop. Now I'm using this term painting very loosely because I don't really know much about digital painting. So yeah. <laughs> I had taken a break from doing some digital art stuff because I just wasn't very happy with the way the art was looking and I wasn't having very much fun with the digital art process. I was enjoying traditional art a lot more. Um, so I one night I took my sketchbook and I drew Yzma from The Emperor's New Groove. Uh, by the way, that is one of my favorite Disney movies. Uh, so yeah, if, if you guys haven't watched it, I really recommend that movie. Um, and I was pretty happy with the way the sketch turned out, and except for the arms and the body. Um, but I won't really go into that. <laughs> but a couple days later, I decided to color the sketch in Photoshop. And I really wanted to add in shading, highlights, and really wanted to try and blend the colors together. So I tried to do all that, and I don't know if I su did that successfully. I, I didn't do awful, but I don't know if I really, really um, grasped what I really wanted to do with it, if that makes sense. Um, I felt like the whole look just kind of needed to be a bit more polished. Uh, but yeah, I think this took me about an hour and 45 minutes to do, so I think if I had spent a couple more hours on it, maybe, I could have really dialed in this, like, loose, sketchy, like, first layer and maybe build it up some. I don't know. Um, maybe that's something I'll have to do in the future, <laughs> but yeah. The face actually wasn't too bad at all, but I wish the eyes looked a little different. Um, I think just the, like... The angle of them because in the like reference picture I was using her eyes are a lot more kind of painted not painted um like tilted up a little bit more and mine are kind of just straight across the face a little bit so I wish I had like you did the transformation tool and um try and like tilt them a little bit more I didn't do that <laughs> I really regret it now lately in my sketchbook I've actually been really having fun drawing um like fan art of Disney, like from my favorite Disney movies and like drawing my favorite characters and having them in my sketchbook. There's just something about creating and recreating fan art and like the characters from the movie. It's just like one of my favorite things to do. I used to do it all the time and I kind of stopped doing it once I had gotten my new sketchbook. Um, just because I really wanted to try and create my own characters and my own designs. But just recently I started again doing just some more fan art and I, I forgot how much I love doing it it's just one of my favorite things um so yeah let me let me talk about this uh process in the photoshop really quickly um let me tell you this was so many different layers I didn't name them which I probably should have and I like I everything got a little bit jumbled in there kind of lost so I kept having to like search through things like ch click the I button and like so I can see them and all that so yeah <laughs> um, looking at this now it's been a couple days since I've done this and I can tell I think on this right shoulder that I'm looking on the right her shoulder right here it's kind of pointing out a little too much so I think I should have brought that in like with the other elbow not the elbow I'm sorry my sh the shoulder <laughs> um because it just looks like it's a little far out and I this let me tell you this body took me it took me a little while because it gave me a lot of gave me a lot of issues um, especially in the sketch and like in the sketchbook I just kind of ended her arms strangely I couldn't really figure out how I wanted to like have them still facing forward because in the scene she's actually in like this backpack tent if you if you haven't seen the movie you, movie, you won't know what I'm talking about. Um, but she's actually sitting down with her hands like on um, hand rest. So yeah, it, it was wasn't the easiest pose. So but uh, yeah, I was actually pretty pretty happy with it. Um, I realized I just said pretty pretty to like <laughs> in a row. That was strange. Um, oh, so here I was actually trying to do a little bit of a glow effect on the gem on the top. I couldn't really figure out how to do that. <laughs> I've never actually done it before and it kept giving me a little bit of issues and all of that. Um, so yeah, I think 
that is pretty much it. Uh, I know this is kind of a shorter video today. Uh, I hope you guys don't mind, but let me tell you, the longer videos just kind of are a pain to upload. <laughs> but yeah, I think that is it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed. I had a lot of fun with it, and I hope to see you guys in my next video. Bye!